Hey everyone, welcome to my first YouTube video. My name is Martha and um, I'm trying to do things this year that get me out of my comfort zone. So uh, this is really uncomfortable. Uh, though I'm really excited to be here and be doing this video here for you today. I'm sorry if I'm kind of like shifting back and forth. I'm on a swivel chair and it's really distracting for me because apparently I'm like five years old. So yeah, ignore that. Uh, today I wanted to go ahead and bring you a haul video. Uh, why did I make that my first video instead of a like get to know me? I don't know. Um, I did this on a whim and apparently I didn't put much thought into it. So we're gonna go ahead and roll with it, okay? Um, as you get to know me, you'll know that I'm not very um, smart, apparently. Uh, so we're just gonna go ahead and get started. Um, again, my name is Martha. Um, I'm old, so I'm not gonna go ahead and, you know how like when women are like, you shouldn't ask women their age, that's rude. Um, I've never believed in that, but I'm still not gonna tell you my age. So we're just gonna go ahead and, um, I just wanna go ahead and let you know that uh, I've always loved fashion. I've always loved like putting outfits together and doing that sort of stuff. So that's just why I went ahead and started with that. Um, my mom would say that when I was small, I would go into the, go back into my room and then like change outfits and come back out into a different outfit like every five minutes don't know why I did that um, I think if I were to do that now people would think I'm off like there's a circuit it's just not connected there you know how, like in college when they would be like on your first day of classes they'd be like uh, you have to introduce yourself and come out with like a, two facts two fun facts about yourself I was never good at that I hated that I didn't like talking about myself which is ironic since I'm doing a YouTube video, but still, like, I would count the people in front of me and be like, okay, I'm third in line, so I have to come up with, like, a fun fact about me in 2.5 seconds. I had nothing except that um, I like to stay at home with my dog and watch Gilmore Girls, so that was a great experience for me. Um, I don't know how I passed any of my college classes, but here we are yet again. I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I hope you stick along for my YouTube journey. Who knows what else I'm gonna go ahead and bring out, you know? I'm not that interesting, but we're gonna make it work, you know? Uh, so I'm glad that you're here with me as we make videos. You'll get to know more about me and um, my likes, dislikes, my... Um, life you know uh i'm the youngest of four girls that's a lot of kids i still ask my mom why that's the thing that the, not that i'm judging my mother my mother's awesome mom i know you're the only person watching this so hi um dad hey what's up Como estas? um and you know they're probably my only two subscribers so that's great i love them thank you for sponsoring this video mom and dad and thank you for sponsoring my life jesus christ too he's awesome oh and now that i mentioned that i do also just want to go ahead and mention that all of the outfits are or all of the dresses that i'm showing here today are modest um i do dress modestly i am apostolic you know what that means? um that meaning i know i people always ask me like why do you wear nothing but skirts and dresses like what the heck is wrong What's with you it's 40 degrees outside and you're in a skirt i'll let you know why so i um we believe it's not a religion but let me just throw that disclaimer out there okay a lot of people say oh it's your religion no senora <gasps> it is my belief okay these are what we call our beliefs we believe in the doctrine that the apostles actually left so um, the apostles that followed Jesus Christ and his teachings, that's what we believe in. Those are our personal beliefs. Not to say that if you don't believe in that, you're incorrect. And our belief is to love people like Jesus loved people. So um, what we do is we evangelize. We talk to people about Jesus and Jesus' love for them. And that's as far as it goes. Like we're not going to put a gun to your head and be like, you better believe now or you're going to see Jesus soon. Um, that's not our doctrine and that's not what we believe in. Um, that's also a little violent and I'm sure that would cost me some time in jail. So, not gonna do that. Um, but 
yeah, we don't force our beliefs on anyone. If anyone has any questions, we're so happy to share that with everyone. Um, and as you, again, as you watch my videos, you'll kind of see what I'm about, what my life is about, and uh, you'll get a better explanation of that as well. So again, I am apostolic and I wear just dresses and skirts. That's just my life. I don't plan to change that. I've never changed that. If you knew me, like in elementary and middle school and high school, which none of you probably do, but if you do, hey, go Minutemen. Um, I would just like to say that you you saw me in a skirt. I am still the same. I haven't changed. I'm still the little brown girl, you know, from Texas, and that's who I'm always going to be in my skirt. Even if it's snowing outside, um, I'm going to be in a skirt, and that's just my life. You can make fun of me. You can poke and point my way and laugh Loser. at me, throw rocks at me, um, but if you throw rocks at me, I'll probably take you to court. So that last one is just a little touchy for me. Um, but yeah, so that's just who I am and that's just how I've always been and that's how I will always be. And that's just my own personal beliefs. Again, if you don't believe in that, no problem. We're still Amigas Cheetahs, okay? So there's that. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and stop talking because I'm going on a rant. I never, ever talk this much. If you know me, again, nobody does. Hey, mom. Hey, dad. Um, I never talk this much at all. So um, we're going to go ahead and get started. Uh, the first dress I have here is a dress. Great explanation, Martha. Great. Um, this is just a... Um, a sleeveless dress here it has like a a couple of ties here that you tie it to your shoulders and then it never comes off <gasps> ever again no so you can adjust it using these ties here uh, which i really like i think that's a cool detail of the, just because you can like if it doesn't fit you you just you're literally like adjusting this to how you want it and exactly how like tight or high or low you want it um but yeah this is just a really cool detail i like I've always liked the ones that are like thicker straps too that you tie. It's just a cute detail. It's I'm going to say the word cute like 50,000 times in this video, but cute. So I've always liked this color. It's like a golden brown color. Obsessed with this. I have like 20 jackets probably with this color on it. And I'm telling you, I don't know why. I When I like a color, apparently I have to get like everything in that color. So there's that. I also like the way it's paired with black. I think that's like a really good contrast. And I'm so going to be wearing this with like a black turtleneck. I think a turtleneck makes you look like way cooler than you are. So I'm going to be doing that. Uh, and it's just like a long um, length. And then it has like a, a peekaboo slit here, which uh, is right here. So yeah, it, it also gives you like some option to run if you want to. Like if you want to play baseball on this, cool. Like wear it and you'll have a big old slit so you can make a home run. So that's cool. Uh, and so I just really like this. And I am also, I think I'm trying these on as well. So if I am, you'll see it better. And this, this that I'm doing here is not showing you anything, but I'll show you better representation. So next I have this, if I can entangle it, uh, this red dress. Okay, so I've never, I don't have a lot of red dresses. I wanted more red dresses, so I was shopping online and I saw this and I was like, add to cart. I'm obsessed, obsessed with wraparound dresses. I don't know why, they're just easy. Actually, I shouldn't say that. My first wraparound dress that I got was just like, mom, how do you do this? I'm lost. And she was just like, it's not that hard. You're like 35. Why can you not figure this out? But it's just like you, there's like a hole on the side and then you have to put like the string through the hole. So apparently it was rocket science to me. Um, again, uh, I apparently not that smart. So my mother had to help me, but that's cool. It's cool. We figured it out. We're living life now. I love um, but yeah, this isn't going to be such a great representation because like, you know, I can't really show you what it would look like actually on, but again, I'm pretty sure I'm showing you how it looks on here shortly. And it's just a long sleeve. It has a polka dot print and it goes all the way down here. 
here. This one doesn't have anything other. And it doesn't have anything other special um, to it. Just that it's a really cute print, and I really, really like it. So there's that. The next dress I have here is another red dress because I really wanted red dresses and it's another long sleeve one. Um, it also, these, a lot of these have like the cinched like sleeves. Can you see that? Uh, no, nobody can see that. You're terrible. Oh, here we go. You see like the little stretchy sleeves that when you put it on, it like cups your hand. Okay, that shows nothing, but it cups your hand and it like it's like a suction on there and it's like I'm not moving until you move me. So I really like the way those like kind of form fit onto your onto your um, wrists. So cute detail. Um, this is just like it has like a v-neck thing going on here. I usually like safety pin them to wherever I want them. But yeah, it's just straightforward. It's a long dress. It has like a ruffle detail starting here where my finger is and it's really cute. I like it. Um, if you were to put a belt with this, yes. Um, this next dress that I have is, okay, I'm already showing it. Um, it's a maroon dress. It's a Dalmatian print. From all my years in the fashion expertise in the fashion world and going to New York Fashion Week in Paris and Milan, I know that this is technically called a Dalmatian print and so here it is. Uh, but yeah, this print is really cool. It's like, let's see, there you go, get your life. Uh, this is a Dalmatian print. It's like kind of like a, like a polka dot, but not. It also has those uh, stretchy sleeves that hang on to you and don't ever let go like a good man should. Uh, and then this has like buttons. I think these are fake. Give me one second and I'll let you know if they're fake. Uh, yes, these are fake. Okay, so it makes you look like you put to, you put it like you took your time to button that and make sure like you have your life together and obviously you don't. You just slip this bad boy on and you're like effort, okay? Fashion, expertise. Uh, this has a a uh, waist. Uh, uh, what is this called? Um, uh, tie waist. A waist tie. Waist tie. That sounds better. Um, a waist tie that you just go ahead and tie on your waist. Nobody needed an explanation for that. Um, it's pretty self-explanatory, but here it is. I love the color of this dress. I want to wear this with like some black booties and some black tights if it gets cold and call it a day and live my Dalmatian print life in Milan. thing I have is a this is a navy dress so I um, this dress is just it has like a v-neck here it's a long sleeve with that stretchy sleeve man this this video has a theme stretchy stretchy sleeves and waist ties is the theme today if you guessed that right you just want an iPad I'm just kidding this is my first video I don't I don't have money or sponsorships um, but yeah this dress is cute it reminds me of like the lanes on a road so that's cute um, and it's just navy it has this waist tie again and then down here where my finger is it has the ruffle like it it has like uh, stitching around the, the bottom and it has like a ruffle that goes out which a lot of these dresses have and I think that's so cool because it it's not just like straight down you know what I mean it kind of gives it like a shape uh, design and like a lot of these dresses with the waist ties I actually don't use these I'm actually uh, I'm a liar uh, I don't use a lot of these that they actually come with so as I was mentioning before I have a lot of belts I feel like with belts if so if you put like a different color to them it makes it pop so for example that one has how it has like the white lines if you were to put a white belt with that with some white booties yes that's the way to go in life and so I just feel like when you put a belt it kind of contrasts it and the waist ties that it comes with it's like sometimes they blend in too much and it's not that cute but you know you do you I'm not here to judge you unless you wear waist ties um, 
And so the next item I have here is this dress. Now, wait a second. Wait a second, okay? We're gonna wait. You're not ready? No, you need to wait, okay? Um, this dress, just because I, I care about its personal feelings, I don't want you to judge it, okay? This dress is cute when it is on a person. The person meaning me, okay? This is really cute. I know it looks like a hospital gown. I know it looks like something a nurse would wear in 1956, but it's really cute. And I'm gonna, you're obviously gonna see it on, but this is what I'm talking about. It Now, listen, it has these like awkward length sleeves, but they made it kind of cute by cuffing it. I'm all, I'm all for a cuffed sleeve, okay? And it has these pockets that are so big like all of your hopes and dreams can fit in here okay but it's it's nice okay when i wore this for uh, our, one of our services and again i use the same white belt i use for everything and um some ankle waist white heels ankle waist that made no sense the ankle strap that's what I was trying to say. Ankle strap white heels and they were, the outfit was a 10 out of 10, okay? And I know because my mom told me. So, I love you, so the next item I have is a blue dress. Now, similar to the, all the red dresses I bought, uh, I don't think I had a lot of blue in my life. So hence me wearing a blue shirt now. Uh, I, I just like, I was like, why am I being so prejudiced towards the color blue? I don't know, but it made me blue. <laughs> that was a really bad joke. Anyways, uh, I have this dress here that just covered my whole face. It is so nice. It's It fits me really well. Again, it's a long sleeve because apparently I don't show my arms. I don't know. Uh, and it's... It is pretty like, I mean, it's just a dress, but it has a floral print. We all know each other now here. We know she's obsessed with a floral. It's just her life. And so I think this is really nice. The color of this is really nice. I didn't have anything like this ever in my closet. Um, but yeah, it just has a zipper in the back and that's pretty much a basic dress. I mean, it's nice. It was cheap. I believe it was like actually that one wasn't the cheapest one i got it was like 15 bucks and the reviews were like um this dress is really nice and it came in pink and i wanted the pink one but i didn't get it so i got the blue one because the reviews were just like going crazy about this dress so i believed them and i bought it uh the next dress i have um this is super cool it has like a uh, short sleeve here so it, i find it to be i know it looks dressy but i feel like short sleeve is kind of casual uh just depending on the item uh, i would still wear this with like a jean jacket maybe if it's windy outside and then like a baseball cap because apparently i'm obsessed with baseball caps um and i like the way it it the material is just like you know when it's good material you know like you know you know um so this material is like really thin but not cheap it's like really nice material it's like breathable and it's like um i don't know if anyone irons out there anymore i have to iron everything like if i'm gonna take a shower and i'm gonna come out my clothes that i'm going to wear when i come out it it needs to be ironed if not i can't survive i think i get that from my dad like he irons like we would go into his like room at 10 o'clock at night and he would be ironing like his socks what and at first we were like apa are you okay but then like as i got older i can relate you know like i understand dad i understand i'm sorry i ever judged you you know sometimes when you're young you don't understand these things but as you get older you start to understand how important life is and life decisions are 
And I'm sorry I ever judged you for ironing your socks. I understand. Um, so, anyways, as I was saying, this dress is cute. And I love this color. I don't have a color like this, so I'm really, really glad I got this color. Again, she has a waist tie. We're probably never going to use her, but we appreciate it. We appreciate it. All right, so the next item I have here is this beautiful blue floral dress. Can we just take a second for the color of this dress? Like, yes, Lord. You done did it. You done did it. Uh, this dress, I had nothing like this except for the dress I showed you like two dresses ago. But this dress is like a more, like a brighter blue. It's so pretty. Um, the, the sleeves kind of go out here like they're like a, like a, it's like a bell bottom, like jean. You know the bell bottoms that like they kind of go out like that? That's what that is. We're going to go with that. A bell bottom sleeve, if you will. Um, this is also a wraparound dress. So again, this presentation is trash and we apologize for that. Um, but it's really pretty. It goes all the way down like so. And it just ties and I wore this to church. I was feeling myself. Um, I had white booties on because she's basic like that. And so that dress is really cheap. The um, reviews on that were really good. So I was just like, yes, let's do it. Okay, this next dress that I'm going to show you here now, now, let's, okay, going back to the subject of reviews, okay? I appreciate you people who leave reviews on food establishments, okay? Thank you for your time. I didn't know if I wanted to try that burrito, but now I am going to try it just because of you. So thank you. Uh, people who review other things, like clothing or gadgets or just stuff like that. Who says gadgets? Nobody. Um, electronic stuff. Um, you, I don't appreciate, not so much. And I'll tell you why, okay? Now, um, people who just want to complain in life just to complain like I'm not down with that all right so the reviews on this dress were like this is weird it cuts you weird the chest area is weird everything's weird we are weird 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 I being myself being the picture I saw on the model I'm like she looks fantabulous okay first of all and uh, I know you took 10 minutes to write that review but I don't believe you and I'm gonna challenge you and I'll be the judge of that myself, okay? I thank you for taking your 25 minutes to write the three page review, but I don't believe you. And I'm going to have to make my decisions for myself because I'm a woman and I can do that, okay? So the reviews on this dress were like, nah, don't, don't get that. And I was like, yeah, I'm gonna get that. Um, and it's just this white long sleeve dress. Again, I didn't have anything like white in my closet, so this is what we got. She has a floral print, a really cute blue, um, oh, I don't know what kind of flower that is, but it's a floral print. And I was just like, yes, okay, yes. She has a waist tie. Are we surprised? No, we're not. You're getting to the point in the video where you're like, she has no originality and she's basic. Loser. Facts. So it just like has buttons that go down the whole dress. I really like it. I tried it on. I was like, <laughs> all you little reviews, y'all were having a bad day. This dress is nice. So uh, again, yeah, I just really, really like that. Uh, I don't have anything like that. So the theme of this year, 2022, getting things you don't have and uh, I, I'm doing that. If you want to see how I style all of these items, you can head over to my Instagram where I have like five followers. No, but you can head over to my Instagram. Um, I have a reel on there that's uh, called OOTDs or Outfit of the Days and that's where I um, put all my outfits that I, that I put together. Um, 
so yeah that's where I keep all of them and uh, just in case you ever want to see how I style all of these today I'm just showing you how they look on like with nothing else but on my Instagram I show you how, how I actually style these this next item I have um, I really like the print it reminds me of like a 70s print like a couch or a pillow you would see in the 70s what that was really specific but I don't know I didn't live in the 70s but I mean I heard it was cool so um, so this is a 70s dress no I'm just kidding no the print reminds me of the 70s it still has a okay um, it has like a couple of buttons here at the top um, and then it just goes out to this rest of this dress again I don't have any colors like this the orange and pink so it's like a burnt orange a lighter orange and then a pink super super cute I feel like with a brown like a I have like a, this perfect brown belt that again I try to wear with everything uh, so I feel like that belt with this would look nice maybe some I don't know we'll have to see how we style this but this is super cute I like this I like the colors it smells good so yeah anyway so this is the next dress I have here uh, it's a black and white dress so I love black and white yes the best combination ever um, I didn't have something with a floral print believe it or not in black and white wait actually I do I'm lying I'm such a liar that's a sin so pray for me um, I do have something black and white print but it's not this nice so this is again this material is really nice because it's breathable um, like it's you can wear this on a hot day and you're not gonna turn into a chicharron so cool uh, it has the uh, like a little elastic around the sleeve so it's it like if I suddenly gain weight in my wrists this is gonna adjust to that weight so yeah um, this has like a cute little scoop neckline and then it goes all the way down it has a ruffle detail at the bottom I just feel like this dress is really nice I'm gonna pair this every black and white thing I have I try to pair it with like red and my dad is like that doesn't match and I'm like he does you may know everything but I know fashion um, so yeah, I just feel like that was really nice. This next item that I'm sneakily trying to get onto the camera here is this, uh, what is this color? Poppy. It's a poppy red. No, it's not poppy. Um, it's a like a red orange. It's really intense. This, these sleeves are like a little fan out moment. Uh, this material is really good. It's like, I don't know why I just stuck my nose through that, but it, the opportunity was there. So this color is, I know I don't have anything this color. For real. I'm not lying. I'll never lie to you. We've only known each other, what, 30 minutes? But I wouldn't lie to you. Um, this, Gucci. Cállate. O te pego. I don't hit my dog, by the way. I don't believe in that kind of violence. Um, but yeah, now that I actually, Gucci. This is my dog, Gucci, and she's the cutest thing ever. Now, I know she looks like Chewbacca. I know she looks like uh, Takwache. Uh, she kind of looks like a sloth. She kind of looks like, you know, all these things in one. It's okay, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Don't hate me. Uh, she has a little, little bit of tear staining going on here, but it's okay. She prays to the Lord every night and she, she just gets into it. So she has to cry those tears. It stains her eyes. It's okay. Um, but yeah, this is my dog Gucci. So if you ever hear barking in the back of my videos, this is the reason. This is the reason. But I love her. Um, anyways. Yeah, so that's all of the things I have today, guys. I don't know if that was a lot or if it was a little bit and you're like, that was trash. I'm sorry if it was um but yeah those are just the most recent dresses i've gotten and i hope you like them again if you want to see how i style these i will be posting that on my instagram story uh so head on over there all right guys that's all for today and i hope you have a great rest of your day stay blessed and have a good one i'll see you in the next video
Yeah. Okay. Go back. Oh, no one does peace signs anymore. Loser. Um, anyways, bye guys. Have a great rest of your day and y'all take care. Um, stay blessed. Don't spread cheese me. And um, cook your tortillas right. Make sure they're the right consistency. That's how you get a man. All right. All right, guys. Bye.